Hi there. Welcome to Techie Toys. The purpose of this instructional video is to show you just how quick and easy it is to set up Broken Girl. If you are not using the included 6 volt 2 amp DC adapter, the only things that you will need to set up your Broken Girl are a small Phillips screwdriver to open the battery compartment and a brand new set of four AA alkaline batteries, sold separately. We suggest taking everything out of the box before you begin. Your parts list is as follows. Metal pole with plastic hooks, wooden base, telescoping metal poles, upper body, blister chest, feet, module, waist bracket, and adapter. First, attach the telescoping metal poles to the wooden base, matching A to A. While holding the four telescoping metal poles near the base, extend the poles upwards with your other hand until all four poles are locked into place. The poles are fully extended when you hear two audible clicks. Next, slide the feet over the metal poles that are connected to the wooden base. Snap lock the module to the metal poles, matching B to B. Note, the module labeled front will be pointing the same direction as the front of the feet. Now, attach the waist bracket into the holes on either side of the module inserting the prongs facing down. The fabric on the waist bracket should be facing the same direction as the front of the feet. Snap lock the metal pole with plastic hooks to the upper body, matching C to C. The pole labeled front should be pointing in the same direction as the face. With the shirt lifted up, attach the blister chest using the hook and loop fasteners to the front portion of the upper body. Next, snap lock the upper body to the module, matching D to D. When securing the upper body to the module, be sure to hold the top of the metal pole with plastic hooks to prevent the item from falling backwards. The upper body should be pointing in the same direction as the feet. Holding the top of the metal pole with plastic hooks, secure the left and right plastic hooks on the metal pole to the left and right fasteners on the module. Connect the cables located under the clothes to the cables coming from the module, matching E to E and F to F. Now, Pull the inner white fabric down to the waist bracket and secure the hook and loop fasteners around the waist bracket. If you are using the included 6 volt 2 amp DC adapter, you will need to remove any batteries and replace the battery compartment cover. Plug the adapter into the DC adapter jack on the module. Plug the other end into a power outlet. If using batteries, insert four brand new AA alkaline batteries into the battery compartment. Turn the switch on top of the module to the on position to operate in sound activation mode. Clap or make a loud sound to activate Broken Girl. Be sure to leave the switch in the off position when not in use. Lastly, Pull down Broken Girl's dress and adjust clothing for an unlifelike appearance. This is important. Keep the arms in the original L shape for Broken Girl to operate correctly. You may need to adjust the arms slightly to make sure the arms are in the same shape as pictured here. Your setup is now complete. Make sure to place Broken Girl on level ground to ensure the best operation, and keep the surrounding area clear of obstructions that may hinder her movement. 
If you have the foot pad, which is sold separately, connect the plug carefully to the jack marked foot pad located on the module. Move the switch on the module into the foot pad position to enable foot pad activation. Place the foot pad in front of Broken Girl and step on the foot pad to activate. For more information, visit our website at techietoys.com and click on customer support for other helpful tips in troubleshooting. Also available are downloadable instructions and product setup videos. You can also click on the item to find where to purchase additional optional equipment, such as foot pad triggers for activation and replacement DC adapters. Thank you, and happy haunting!